In this screencast, I'll show you how to use Excel to fit a polynomial to a set of XY data. One way to do that is to highlight the XY data and insert a scatter graph. Then you can simply add a trend line, select polynomial. In this example, we'll use a fourth order polynomial, display the equation, and press close. And there we have our fourth order polynomial fitted to the XY data. Now, the only problem with this is that these values aren't actually linked into the spreadsheet and can't be used for any further calculation. So what you'd have to do is copy and paste them into the spreadsheet and then use them after that. And if this XY data got updated, then these values would change, but the values in the spreadsheet wouldn't. So another way to go about this is to use a modified version of the Linest equation. To do this, we have to press equals and type Linest open brackets, we highlight the y data, comma, highlight the x data, and we have raised this x data to um, a power of 1, 2, 3, and 4, because this is a fourth order polynomial. So we raise it to the power, and we have to use curly brackets for this. Open the curly brackets, 1, comma, 2, comma, 3, comma, 4. Close the curly brackets, close the overall brackets, and hit enter. Now because this is an array function, we have to highlight all the cells that the function is going to read its values out to, press F2 and then press Control, Shift and Enter. And there we have the five coefficients that we need for the fourth order polynomial and you can see that those match the coefficients on the graph for the line of best fit. And that is how you can use Excel to fit a polynomial to a set of XY data.